the Store e Data Integrity Software option, formerly called User Rights. The Store e Software option for data integrity provides the technical controls to ensure good data management practices. Star e enables access control, user level management, user group specific data access, and data classification. Each of these features, including a general introduction to data integrity, are presented in five separate how-to videos. Essential for regulated industries, such as food and pharma, the data integrity option also benefits non-regulated industries with a strong focus on quality, for example, the automotive industry. Access control restricts system access to authorized individuals only. Each user must therefore have a unique user identity and password for login access. In this short video, you will learn how to create unique password protected user accounts in Star E software. Only a user with administrator rights can set up and configure user accounts in Star E software. Start by logging on to the software and click Install Window. Then select Home User Accounts from the main menu bar. On the User Accounts page, enter the first names, last names, and email address of the new user to the relevant fields. The Notifications option allows you to configure email alerts coming directly from Star e Software. The procedure is explained in a separate how to video titled How to Configure Email Alerts in Star e Software. To enable single sign ons, enter the username of an existing Windows user in the Windows User field. Rather than assigning individual permissions directly to each user, permissions are grouped into roles. Predefined roles can be selected from the drop down list shown here. The User Rights feature is covered in Part 3 of this video series. Users and generated data can also be assigned appropriate clearance levels to control who has access to data. These aspects are further elaborated in Part 5 of this video series. The Change Password Next Time User Logs On default setting automatically prompts first-time users to set their passwords. Accounts no longer in use can be disabled by selecting Disable User Account. Add any optional information to the Remarks field and click File, Save. In the Save As dialog box, enter the username. Make sure it does not contain any at characters. You have now successfully created a new user account. Thank you for watching. This concludes our video on how to set up unique user accounts in Star E Software.